Derek's on top of me in the mount. I'm just gonna show you a simple, um, and it could be effective with the counter to the Americana. So what I'm gonna do is, if I leave my hand out here, a lot of times they'll, they'll have the hands up, right? Because they might be punching or striking, trying to get in, or I might be posting and then he's able to get a hand. So the basic Americana, you know, is gonna be in this position here. And the key is when he gets it, go ahead and go in that position. The key is when he has his right hand there, he's kind of stuck it underneath it toward the uh, elbow. So bring, bring toward the yeah, elbow to the hip and then he'll lift it up and there's the basic one. So you'll notice his right hand has to go under and it's very similar to basically it's a standing up figure four but on the ground, right? So if I can eliminate him doing that underhand figure four, then he's gonna be very difficult in, in uh, finishing off this position. So up here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring my elbow in and I'm just gonna show you on this side here. So even if he has the arm right here, and the elbow and everything looks good, he has problems getting his right hand underneath that figure four position. So go ahead and try to get it. And as long as he leaves the knee there, he's in a good spot, right? And if he can get my elbow out, then he can finish it. Okay, other side. So for me to counter this elbow, I have to early in the early phase, this is the late phase, I have to get my elbow in so when he pushes it down, it's there. Another thing that can help me keep his knee down, because his knee can also spread out and allow his uh, sidearm to go underneath it. So if I take this foot and I kind of wedge it in tightly, and then I get my hand or my elbow in, then he can try it. He may start out, and then he realizes he really can't get a good hold of it to finish on that Americana. So that's all we're doing. He'll go to this side. I'll quickly bring my elbow in. I'll tighten up my legs. He has problems. He goes to the other side. I'll quickly bring my elbow in, and it's just to kind of buy me time for a little bit. Eventually, he'll be able to muscle it out in many cases because he's got two arms on one. But again, in a street fight, if he does go down, right, you know, what's to keep me from doing all these strikes also here? And when he has his weight shifted on this side, he's off balance, and he's taking away a lot of weight off the hip side, and we'll cover that in another video. Good job.